all right uh, so so far we have done with the variation grouping and uh, what is remaining is this uh, plus button and minus button and this uh, uh, remove from the cart okay so uh, let's uh, first to start with uh, the plus button okay so as i showed you before this is actually uh, you know it is uh, actually working but uh, uh, the problem is it is not adding the uh, variation okay as you can see when i click on this it is adding the you know incrementing the uh, quantity okay so uh, let's uh, make it work now uh, go back to the cart.html page here okay so uh, uh, see we have this uh, minus button okay so this is the minus button so this is the plus button so uh, what we have to do here is uh, we just uh, uh, send the post request okay because uh, as you can see in the views.py file uh, if you go here add cart function okay because uh, this this is uh, coming to the add cart function right so add cart and uh, this is bringing the product id okay so product id we are getting uh, but uh, from here we are getting the uh, request method post okay so then only we are uh, getting uh, inside okay inside uh, where we are getting the uh, product variations so for that reason we will have to make it uh, uh, put it inside a form okay let's say form and uh, here and the action will be the same URL okay uh, then the method is equal to post and then uh, CSRF token then and let's uh, make this uh, you know uh, remove this A and make it a button and uh, we don't need this href now and type will be submit and and this closing anchor tag also make it a button and then let's uh, uh, loop through the uh, you know loop through the uh, variations for item in card item dot variations dot all and let's first end this for loop and for so here it will be uh, you know a button class okay uh, not button so here we should say uh, input with the hidden type and its uh, name will be item dot item dot um, you know a uh, variation category variation category and this should be a uh, lower case okay and uh, the value will be item dot variation Variation value and this will be tap first. All right, so this will bring us the color and you know variation category and the uh, variation value. So I think this should be this should be fine. Let's uh, uh, you know let's go to the cart refresh okay i think uh, i think some closing tag is missing or something is the form action uh, 
okay so uh, you see what happened here it should be actually outside the for loop okay so now this should be fine all right so now uh, what will happen is when i click on this uh, you know plus button so it will okay so now you see it is working okay so the same way if i click on the uh, blue and medium plus button so this blue and but uh, medium uh, quantity is uh, increasing all right so uh, that part is done now so now the uh, now we have to handle this uh, minus button also let's go back to the same page here so for the minus button uh, what should happen is say, uh, uh, let me show you um, uh, this is uh, a remove cart right so uh, let me find this remove cart so here it is so in the remove cart function we actually need a, a cart item id okay cart item underscore id so this we should get from the uh, from here only okay so after this cart item dot product dot id we will have to say cart item dot id so we should also uh, modify the urls.py file uh, here remove cart product id and this will be again int colon and this uh, cart item id okay then this uh, let's go to here we have the product id and cart item uh, cart item id so the cart product and uh, what we'll do is we'll make a try block and move this inside cart item is equal to cart item dot objects dot get product equal to product and cart equal to cart and id equals cart item id okay so then uh, if a cart item uh, you know cart item uh, dot quantity is greater than one then the uh, remaining things will be same and uh, after this uh, try we will just say accept so in the accept block we don't need to actually do anything let's just pass it okay so now we can uh, uh, try this one now just uh, do a refresh let me uh, try to decrease the quantity yes this is working okay so increment also working and the decrement also working and if i decrement it to zero then this product is uh, you know card item is deleted uh, so the same way we will fix this uh, remove button okay so let's uh, go to the code again card.html so we have a, um, a remove button here so this is a remove cart item cart item dot product dot id and again we will need cart item dot id okay and go back to the urls the same thing just copy it and paste it okay so this will be remove cart item product id cart item id just copy this cart item id and pass it here okay so this will be now cart product uh, get object of 404 then cart item objects product equals product cart equals cart id equals to id equals to cart item id okay then this uh, delete so now we can try this uh, remove yes this is removed and this is removed and this is removed okay so it is uh, actually uh, just uh, as soon as i click this it is just getting removed so what we'll do is uh, we'll just uh, make a 
um, when I click on this uh, remove button so it should just ask me are you sure you want to uh, remove this or not okay uh, so that uh, there is no chance of uh, removing this uh, you know uh, accidentally so let's do that uh, go to cart item html so in the href uh, let's say on click uh, this is actually a javascript okay just a piece of javascript uh, to return a alert message you know uh, i mean i can say the confirm alert okay confirm then we say are you sure you want to uh, delete this item okay and now if you uh, refresh and click on this remove so now this is asking me are you sure you want to delete this item okay if i say okay then the further code will run and this item will be deleted otherwise if i do cancel then it is returning false okay so that means it is just cancelled okay so if i remove okay yes this is removed okay so that's how it works and i think uh, that's it i guess so this is uh, um, all right uh, plus is working minus is working and uh, let me once again try the uh, try all this uh, blue medium white small let me add uh, blue medium again blue medium yes this is grouping and if i add something else green large all right so everything is perfect okay uh, so it's been a while so we did not uh, uh, push our code to github all right we will do that in the next one